Hey, what is up mortals it is Robo Celestial here, and before we get into today's video, I would like to remind you all that this is a new channel, please like comment and subscribe to get this channel going. Before we get into the what if, I'll give a quick rundown what boosted gear is. Boosted Gear or, formerly called a Scared Gear or also known as the Red Dragon Emperor's Gauntlet, is a mid-tier Longinus, where the Welsh Dragon, Drake, resides in. The Gauntlet has the ability to enhance the user's capabilities as well as transferring power to anyone or an object. The more power the user gives to X amount of a thing weaker it gets. Boosted Gear will shout boost this doubles the user's physical capabilities and demonic power every 10 seconds until they reach their limit, this is shown by the dragon in the gauntlet saying boost. The user can also store the power of items or weapons, and it allows them to wield their capabilities. The gauntlet can also promote an evil chest piece such as the rook, knight, bishop, and queen. This basically gives the user the power of the chest piece they promote to for an example, if the user promoted to rook he or she would have the traits of a rook which are high defense and attack but have low demonic power and are quite slow. If they promoted to a knight they'll gain the speed of a knight but have a bad defense. If they promote to a bishop they'll get enhanced magical abilities which consume a lot of magic and take time to recharge. If they turn into a queen they'll have an even balance of all three of the pieces. This gauntlet reacts and responds to the user's feeling and desires which can make them stronger or change the gauntlet completely. Also, the gauntlet has a dragon sealed into it that can talk to the user. It might sound overpowered, but it has weaknesses such as magic, dragon slayer magic, curses, and swords. The red dragon emperor's gauntlet balance breaker which can be activated by the gauntlet reacting to the user's feelings and desires but usually the first time is hard to do but after it's easier to do it. Balance breakers have basically hidden the power of any scared gear which you can think of it as a final form in a sense. When the Red Dragon Emperor's gauntlet goes into balance breaker mode it gives a user a full bodysuit that looks like a red dragon called scale mail. With this, the user can double their power every second until they hit their limit, but this drains the user badly and so does the normal gauntlet itself. For this what, if we'll give Deku the final form of the boosted gear as his quirk which gives him the abilities of what was stated previously, and gives him the power to transfer power, but, he will not have his balance breaker yet. I'll be referring to the dragon in the gauntlet, has Drake since it's much easier than making one up. Drake wouldn't know much about this universe and Deku would explain it and talk about it to Drake. Contrary Drake would give insight about his universe too. Deku wouldn't be bullied of all in school because he has a quirk which also means Bakago respects him more, but he's still mean to him because he's jealous of him. Deku would also be more confident than at the start of the anime. Fast forward towards months before the UA entrance exams Bakago says jealously you're planning to join UA? You won't make it, you should just jump off the school building. Deku knows he's jealous of him, so he takes this with a grain of salt and walks home. As Deku is walking home he runs into the sludge villain, as he's about to attack Deku activates his scared gear on his right arm. A red gauntlet with two green jewels and ten golden spikes that manifests on the Deku's arm. The gauntlet yells boost. Deku jumps back and launches a red energy blast which splits the sludge villain in half, but, the sludge villain reforms and attacks again. When suddenly, All Might yells I am here. Missouri smash. Deku is excited he gets to see his idol saving him making winds pushing the sludge villain into a bottle. All Might says I saw what you did good work and stay safe. All Might jump away, but, Deku grabs onto All Might legs making him drop the sludge villain as they head to the rooftop. Deku asks All Might if he can be a hero with his drag interrupts and says he's a really big fan of your even has you all over his room. Deku in embarrassment says stop that that's not true. All Might realize this kid is a mega fan and then laughs while spitting out blood as he becomes skinny Deku freaks out and says are you a fake All Might. All Might says no this is me I had an injury that not even the best of the best doctors could fix. Please keep this a secret will ya? More importantly, your quirk can talk to you? Drake says yes I am a dragon that can talk that's sealed into this gauntlet. All Might is shocked he's never seen a quirk like this before he says you can easily be a hero with that quirk. And leaps away. Deku checks to see if his book is signed and surely ended it is which makes him smile. He walks back home when suddenly he sees a crowd of hero and silvalins. Deku's gauntlet yells boost several times as he's running towards the crowd. Deku sees his classmate Bakago Deku then realizes he made All Might drop the villain. Deku thinking to himself why aren't the heroes doing anything they shouldn't hesitant at times like this. Drake says what are you doing? 
Get in there and save your friend. Deku says but. I'm too weak to help of all anyways all might will be here soon. Drake says you just said a moment ago that heroes shouldn't hesitate at times like these, and yet here you are. You'll never become the number one hero by doing that. Deku says I guess you're right. He runs on and heroes try to stop him, but he's too far ahead, and Drake says boost. Deku launches a red blast it hits the sludge villain barely damaging him the sludge villain says, the vol you go dot, Drake says boost, Deku punches the sludge villain the face, but his hand is stuck in the sludge. The sludge villain laughs and says you fell for it just like this other guy. Deku grins, Drake says boost, and uses a blast to push him out of the sludge villain. The sludge villain expands his arms trying to grab Deku, but he jumps in the air and thinks to himself all might defeat him with wind if I can do the same thing. Must say Drake yells explosion, Deku launches a punch releasing the stored up power in the boosted gear making winds blowing the sludge villain away he runs quickly to grab Bakago. Dragon yell reset Deku is running with Bakago asking Drake why he can't boost anymore. Drake says since you released all the stored up energy you can't boost again for a bit. Deku makes it to the crowd and the crowd cheers when suddenly the sludge villain comes from behind about to attack even more. The heroes and Deku get ready for this when suddenly All Might jump from the sky saying I am here. Punching the villain sending winds that blow him away. The crowd cheers for All Might. All Might takes Bakago and says I'll take him to the police station with the sludge villain. Later in the evening Deku is walking back to his house as All Might dash in and says hello. All Might says thank you I saw what you did out there you inspired me to act. Deku says you shouldn't thank me for you're the one who saved me. And everyone else. All Might says in a couple of months in teaching at UA for class 1A. Deku says really I'm enrolling there too. All Might grin and says. Work hard because the best of the best try to get into that school, and before I forgot here's my personal number, if you need to call me up. Deku says thank you so much. All Might says no problem and jumps away into the sunset.